Hi everybody. Welcome to Coffee with Tammy. So if you don't have a coffee in your hand or a shot glass or whatever it is that you like to watch me to, pause this and go fetch it. Because <laughs> I'm not going anywhere. So anyway, I have for you a tour of the outside of my house. But before we get into all that, I want to apologize for repeating myself several times on a couple of my videos. It's been so long, you guys, since I made videos. Not only that, it's so hard when I'm piecing together videos uh, like the chicken and rice, because I forget that I tell you about, you know, and, and I've been rushing. Yeah, so forgive me. So yeah, since I've got some of that out of the way, I can slow down and enjoy the view. So they say. And so anyway, yes, again, today we're in my bedroom. But I want to let you know that I really enjoyed making the chicken and rice. And this week I'll be making my famous banana bread. And I will be videoing it. I'll have a camera in this time and won't be dropping <laughs> my phone. But at any rate, I want you guys to be patient with me until I get another camera. They're very expensive and the other one... Yeah, it just didn't. It was a generic, and I didn't pay a lot for it. So right now, I'm just trying to, uh, besides save up house funds and van funds, I need to save up for a camera fund. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> One thing after another at our age. But anyway, um, you know, there's a lot of videos I'll be making for this channel that I won't be making for Tammy's RV Life. Uh, part of this video minus this intro and some pictures uh, will be posted over on Tammy's Nomadic RV Life as well. Um, I'm trying to get up a thousand viewers here uh, so that I yeah, don't have to go there so often. And I would like to, you know what, I would like a couple mediators and I would like to do live chat, live video. Um, yeah, so yeah, this, I can't do that until I get a thousand, but we're getting there. We're slowly climbing. I think I have a lot of loyal uh, viewers and subs on the other channel that just haven't come over here yet. <laughs> I've got uh, four other videos in the works right now for you guys. Uh, a couple of them, well, besides the cooking video, uh, there's probably three really heavy subjects. And you know, the reason I opened this channel was so we could come here and talk about day-to-day -day life and the subjects. So please, if you guys have any any suggestions at all, I've already got a couple, uh, post them in comments. I'll write them on my little notepad and we'll get to those subjects as soon as we can. Please remember in your comments to be kind and be nice, that we all have our opinions. We all have our own walks on this earth. And even though a lot of us differ in our opinions, our views, our religions, it doesn't mean we can't come together for a cup of java and a little bit of conversation, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Just saying. So be kind when you're replying to me or anybody else in the comments. And remember, I want you guys to interact. I love it when we interact. I, I think it's amazing when I get one person that says something and, and 10 or 15 of my subs, they're all commenting all back and forth. But anyway, I want you to enjoy yes, a video of the outside of my house. We did take precautions in making sure no addresses were seen and I thank you for worrying. Also, uh, in the little town I live in in Arizona, Apache Junction, it's primarily winter bird, you know, uh, residences here. Uh, there has to be a thousand, and I'm not kidding, nor am I exaggerating, RV resorts that have permanent homes in them, like mine. So if a stalker or somebody was trying to find me, they wouldn't. Just saying, I don't give out my my personal address, and I don't have a P.O. box. So, I, I really, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I don't have really an address to have anything sent to, so it's kind of better that way. But anyway, I hope you guys have a great day. I hope you enjoy the video. I'm going to post some pictures about my change at the end and what I look like now. But that's one of our subjects coming up. Actually, there's probably three subjects in one. 
Anyway, have a great day. Remember to love yourself because if you don't love you, ain't nobody can love you. And not only that, pay it forward. Even if it's a bottle of water, blessings go around in circles, guys. They just do. Anyway, I'll talk to you soon. Enjoy this video. Peace out. <laughs> so bye we're going to start my tour of the outside of my house right here at the back, my favorite spot. If you hear a little dog, it's uh, my girlfriend's dog. She's having surgery. Oops, almost fell. She's having surgery today on her knee, and he's kind of really upset, so I had to cape, put him in his cage. There's my back fence. This shed right here, you guys. Fully finished inside, and one of the things I love about this shed is this old door. It's a door from a really old um, RV. But the inside of that shed is completely finished. You could live in there. So those are the decorations on my wall. And in my back. It's locked, of course. And I have a little string there right now. I just did laundry. And I can't see when I'm, the sun is right in my eyes. So my whole side there. And then I have the whole side here. Of course, Lucy. Yeah. yeah, his name is Sam, and he is quite pissed off. This is the only place on the side that's open and it's lattice. I want to build right here a lattice half wall uh, just for the privacy. Uh, you guys probably see my cameras in the window. I do have surveillance. It's my AC unit. And as I come out, there's a, my neighbor's big old tree that he's got to cut. <laughs> In my driveway. Let's see. Are you there? Because my phone is acting really weird. Hey, there's the front of my house. Let's see if I can get out in the street a little bit. There we go. Front of my little house. There's my enclosed driveway. I have room for three cars. So in the front here, I have some decorations. That blue rock is permanent. Um, it's like three inches deep. They do that here, if you'll notice over here on the other side. Um, yeah, I covered the numbers on my mailbox, guys. I have a wagon wheel there. But um, if you'll notice, down the side of my house is all blue. Look, that's all my property. Let's see here. I'll give you a good view of the side of my house. I, again, I can't really see what I'm videoing. It's so bright out here but it's early morning and my barrel cactus they just cut our trees here yeah oh, that's one of my live plants those are some of my little solar lights pot another live plant so we're gonna my AC unit, as earlier, will be loud. It's on. It's a big Coleman. But there's the area where I kept planted my uh, tomatoes. Didn't do so good. I'll go down the way here. You can see. If you'll notice, there's the deck my friend built for me. You guys, you, it fits so perfect. It was like it was built for this house. My awning goes all the way down the whole length of my patio. We're going to go by this noisy old AC and Sammy's pissed in tree. He knows something's up. He knows his mom is sick. A sliding glass door. This is one of my favorite things. I don't know if you can see it. Let me take you up here. It says, stay positive. And of course, the house is dedicated. I'm going to pass this noisy AC. This plant just started growing out of nowhere, so I let it. That little bitty, you know, that bunny thing? That's a melon. And of course, my Irish ivy and little pink flowers. They're pretty. And my, yeah, this stuff just grows wild, this vine. Oh, he is so pissed off, ain't he? 
Yeah, that's just an old table I gotta get rid of. Chair, my back deck. It's my back door. You see the curtain over that door? These are solar guys. So I have two solars to light up my little rock. That's mine. From that white all the way down is all mine. I just planted this little tree from a sapling. Hopefully it'll grow. There's one of my cactus. But if you'll notice, I have the rock as well all the way down to my second shed. Oh, Sammy is so mad. <laughs> oh. So, and there's my big old palm tree that they just cut. So, as I come around here, you'll see some of my cactus that I transplanted. Oh, Sammy. She's my back gate. More solar. That's a solar sensor. My other shed, which is nice deep shed. Actually, I'll show you. you see, it's it's pretty big. Holds everything I want it to. So anyway, there's my some of my cactus. I planted it around the perimeter because that's my line all the way down to the fence again. And some of my cacti. Uh, this vine was growing when I moved in, but I have all this, and that's one of my favorite things. It was nothing when I moved in, but uh, here I have a six foot fence. That's an alley behind there, but if you'll look, you can see all my plants. Now this was another wild one, and you guys, I, I've been so bad. My girlfriend... Like I said, it's having surgery today. She just got back from Minnesota Saturday. I've just been spending time. I gotta water that today. Okay. But I think those are that tree or that. It's got seeds all over it. So this is the back side of my garden. And if I can't see, I'm going to give you a tour all the way down the street and the back of my house. A huge antenna. I have issues with woodpeckers. I just can't seem to get them to quit pecking on my house. So anyway, that's the outside in my huge backyard. That's the back of my finished shed. I hope you enjoyed this tour. If I got everything you wanted to see. I, I absolutely love my little house. Here comes that noisy AC unit. I don't know what's worse. Him or Sammy. Sammy's mad. You know something's up. This tree has grown way above and beyond my awning, when I moved in, this tree didn't even come up to the awning. So I keep her watered. I have to trim her this year. This is the outside of my garden, my rock area, my neighbor's driveway. Isn't it beautiful? I can't fill the hummingbird feeders, although there are... Ah! I'm growing forks, you guys. <laughs> uh, the woodpeckers will hit those if they have sugar in them and spill them all over so I can't even fill, feed the hummingbirds. But let me tell you about this, my fort garden here. In the middle is mint. And the rabbits as well are terrible here. That's why I got these little plastic things up. But the rabbits absolutely eat everything. Yeah. Everything. So, as we end this tour, I hope you enjoyed it. This is the outside of my little house. I love my little house. That spot's empty. Although they did bring in a few new ones. Let's see if I can get out to the street and get a better shot. Ooh, I'll give you some. Okay. There's the front of my little house. 
There's the front, completely covered. And I know it's so cute, right? I gotta go let that Sammy out. See that pool noodle? That's to chase away the uh, <laughs> woodpeckers. So anyway, I'm sorry about the barking throughout this, but I promised to take care of Sammy while she was having her knee replaced. I gotta go let him out. He thinks he's, he's quite spoiled, Sammy is. And his auntie, he loves his auntie. So I'm gonna let you guys go. I hope you've enjoyed this tour of the outside of my home. You guys have a good day. Remember to love yourself. And remember to pay it forward. Peace out. Well, it's early morning here. It's about 5 a.m. Yeah, 5. Today I'm babysitting my girlfriend's dog. Why she has knee replacement surgery. And her husband is supposed to come and take and bring him over so but before that happened I thought I would try to get in a, a picture of, of my lights on there's my little sitting area it's kind of dark out let me see if I, eh, I don't like that okay come with me let's see if we can get the front yard <coughs> <coughs> sorry see you can tell by the blue of the sky that it's just coming up but I wanted to kind of give you an idea of my solar I don't know, I'm not here am I? <laughs> uh, Mr. Moon hello Mr. Moon okay let's see if I can get you my driveway there we go gosh isn't that gorgeous back there you guys that's my drive area that we, it's fully uncovered I, I told you guys that um, that's what it looks like at night um, some of my yard sticks. I'm trying to be really careful here right now because I haven't uh, hidden my address. And so, that'll be here. My AC just kicked on. But if you look up there, you'll see I have solar lights. I have them hanging in the back, back here. But that's my porch light. My, all my other little solar lights are out, but it's going to be noisy real quick, you guys. But I'm going to take you back here to see my backyard at home as well. Let's see if I can do this. Get ready. The AC unit is noisy. See? Behind the lights. Very hot here. So, like I said, it's very early morning, but I got two. Uh, Solar lights there. I got those little guys. Look at that sun rising, guys. But my whole backyard has little sticks. You can barely see them lit up because, again, the sun's fixing to come up. Yeah, it's gorgeous out here right now. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, God. We just trimmed our palm trees. But my neighbor has this big old spotlight, which is okay. It lights my yard at night. We also have one of these little solar lights. You've just seen it pop on. Uh, that's a solar light that when somebody walks in front of it, it pops on. So anyway, I'll be back in a little while with a full tour of the back, the outside of my house. But let's look at that sunrise. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh gosh, you guys. And my little yard. Oh, I love my yard. Here comes that noisy AC unit. Let's see if we can get you a shot down this way. There we go, that's prettier. Let me see if I can step back over here. Look at the rocks. And get you those little guys. They're little flowers. You can't see it. There's my deck at night from the backside. Anyway, I'll see you in a minute.